Now to the scenario we all fear when too much rain causes flooding, and that's raw sewage backing up into the basements. In one Detroit home, it's so bad the people living there are moving out, and this is also a problem for the next door neighbor. Steve Garagiola shows us the ordeal up close. Their backyard is a disaster. Completely dug up for a couple months now because raw sewage is getting pumped out of the basement and the landlord tells this family, nothing I can do about it. So far deep down here, man, you can't believe it. For six weeks, Zolly Grant and his wife have been living with this in the backyard and this. Sewer just kept coming up in the basement. They pumped it out maybe four different times. Here's the violations from the city of all these different code violations and they have not complied. The landlord had the backyard dug up and his solution has been to pump the water and sewage out of the basement onto the neighbor's property and out into the street. And I'm a cancer survivor, five years this week. I'm cleared, I told him I don't want to develop something else because my system is not up to par. Mr. Grant says he has tried to deal with the property owner, a man named Irving Seals. So I called the landlord, who owns other houses in the area, and he tells me that this really is not his fault. I haven't seen the notice. I haven't gotten the notice. The guy at the house haven't told me about the notice. So I called the mayor's office. Turns out inspectors have been out here several times and came back again this afternoon. The city says the owner will be contacted again. I'm quite sure when it all boils down, Right. Well, I can't do nothing about it. I'm not a plumber. But you could get people out here to fix it. I already did that. So maybe you're asking, why doesn't the family just move? Because it's not that easy. They have. We have to go. We don't have the funds to leave, sir. There is no short-term solution for this mess for the folks who live here. They tell me they will try to move in with other family elsewhere until they hopefully have a home again. In Detroit, I'm Steve Garagiola, Local 4. Okay, Steve, and we just heard back from the city of Detroit. They say their part of the sewage line is clear, so the responsibility lies with the owner of the home. So the city says they intend to go after him until he fixes it.